Hello Capricorn, welcome to your next 48 to 72 hours reading. So Capricorn, these messages are timeless. Whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages could resonate the most. They're also general Capricorn, so not every message will be for you. Just take what applies and leave the rest. So I'm going to go ahead and tap in. Spirit, give me some messages for Capricorn. What can they expect for the next 48 to 72 hours? Messages for Capricorn, what can they expect for the next 48 to 72? What's the energy? What would you like for them to know at this time? What is the energy for Capricorn? What's the message? Rumors. There are rumors being spread. Bottom of the deck Halloween. Significant. Something significant about this holiday. So let's get into it. Why is rumors here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is rumors here for Capricorn? What is the energy? The Seven of Cups. Give me another energy for rumors. Why is rumors here? What is the message? I have the Ten of Cups. So for some of you, somebody could have a lot of options when it comes to love, who they want to be in a relationship with, who they want to have their wish fulfillment with. This person is trying to decide like pretty much who is their Ten of Cups? Who should they take action towards? Ace of Wands. Who should they build a family with? You know, somebody um, is trying to follow guidance here but I feel like this person even though they're trying to allow themselves to be guided with the page of cups like they're still very immature somebody um still needs to grow up here like they don't make the best decisions this person could be led more by passion then emotions somebody could be very emotionally immature this is somebody who could have wishful thinking capricorn yeah it's like this is someone who is very gullible here give me another energy on the seven of cups why is the seven of cups here for capricorn what is the message why is the seven of cups here for capricorn what is the energy I have the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, so somebody could be seeing the number 1010. We do have the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles here. Why is the Seven of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Seven of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the energy? The Queen of Pentacles. So somebody's pretty much trying to decide who they want to make their wife, who they want to commit to. Give me an energy on the Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here? The Knight of Swords. Um, I feel like this person um, could be rushing into a connection or could have already rushed into some type of family dynamic. Somebody could have felt like they were making a good choice when they did this. Somebody could have looked at someone like as their wish fulfillment, Ace of Pentacles as a gift. But now this person is in the Nine of Swords for the lover they chose. Yeah, somebody um, ended up being betrayed by this person. This is someone from their past, somebody they have history with. I feel like something was just short lived here. Like these people, they were celebrating, having a good time. Everything seemed perfect. And then boom, a tower. Somebody um, is starting to realize that they're married to, they're committed to somebody who's very toxic. This is also someone who could like to do things for show, for attention. Yeah, for some of you, I'm hearing power couples. So for some of you, both of these people love attention and even though they're miserable even though you know this is not 
a good relationship, a good marriage. They're still going to put on for the public. Give me an energy on the Ten of Cups. Yeah, but somebody rushed into something really quickly. Give me an energy for... The Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here? What is the message? The Ace of Cups. So this person pretty much like ran away from new love. And just could have chosen to go back towards someone from their past that they felt they were more connected to. Yeah, it's like this person held back from their own happiness. The Sun to the Four of Pentacles to go and reconcile with someone who they have already established some type of foundation with. This person felt like they were making the good choice here. They felt like they were making the proper decision. Give me an energy on the Ten of Pentacles. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Yep, Justice. Yeah, somebody decided to commit to someone, get married. I feel like um, with the Seven of Wands to the Ten of Wands, this person is hiding how burdened they are. This is 17 Wands. So somebody's under a lot of stress. They are heavily burdened. So it's kind of like someone is painting a pretty picture here, Capricorn, but the reality is the seven to the ten of wands. Stress. A lot of burdens, responsibilities, five of swords, yeah. Somebody is very worried here. They're not happy, but when they go out in public, they put on a show. Somebody's juggling a lot here. Somebody um, could be a car salesman, could have like a car lot, could be a mechanic here. Somebody does something with cars. That's what I'm getting for some of you. Give me another energy on the Ten of Pentacles. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Ten of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the message? The Three of Swords, yeah. Someone is heartbroken. That's what this is. Somebody is heartbroken by the decision that they made because whatever they chose, it's a whole bunch of conflict there. A lot of disagreements. I feel like this person is looking back on all of this. Like the decision they made, where they made the wrong turn, how they got themselves here. Somebody is heavily conflicted mentally. But I feel like this is the balance because this is what this person chose. Three of Swords. They pretty much like hurt themselves here. Sabotage themselves. Give me an energy for the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here for Capricorn? Next 48 to 72. What is the message? The Two of Wands and the Two of Cups. So the number 22 could be significant. Yeah, somebody's heartbroken because now, two of wands, look at how this girl is looking out the window. They finally see who their actual two of cups is. That's what it is, Capricorn. That's why this person is in so much anguish. They finally see you or you finally see this person. Somebody knows who their wish fulfillment is, who their two of cups, ten of cups is, who they are supposed to be with. For some of you with the Three of Swords, something could have definitely been a third-party situation. Like I said, with the Seven of Cups, somebody had options here. And then I'm hearing an angel in disguise. So by Brandy, somebody's name could actually be Brandy or begin with the letter B or I. And then I'm hearing A as well. Um, but whoever this person chose to commit to this is somebody who put on a good front this is somebody who acted the part they act very nurturing caring um like they had a very angelic presence but this energy was really low vibrational was very toxic halloween and this masculine or feminine take it as it resonates didn't realize this until they committed to this person why is the queen of pentacles here what is the energy why is the Queen of Pentacles here? I feel like um, people are now starting to talk about these two. It's like whatever illusion they created concerning their relationship, that's wearing off. 
Give me an energy for the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the message? Temperance, Sagittarius energy. Tell me more. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? What is the message? The hangman. I feel like somebody had to go through this change in order to awaken Pisces energy. Somebody um, definitely needed to go through a transformation, King of Swords. Like I said, this person was very immature. You know, this is somebody who was going from a page of cups to a King of Swords. Somebody is becoming more wiser. And it's because of who they're currently dealing with, who causes them a lot of frustration. Somebody's learning a major life lesson here. Somebody's also learning how to trust their own intuition. Give me an energy for temperance. Why is temperance here for Capricorn? What is the message? They saw swords and now they see the truth yeah it was just time for this person to see the truth and what they chose who they committed to also it was just time for this person to see the truth in themselves and realize just how childish they were death at the bottom of the deck scorpionic energy somebody had to go through an awakening a transformation here I feel like with this Empress to the Three of Wands, this person watches you a lot, especially if you have any type of like online presence. It doesn't have to be that you're a content creator. You could just have Facebook, Instagram. I'm also getting like where you and this person were in a relationship. They do look at old pictures of you. Give me an energy for the hangman. Why is the hangman here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the hangman here for Capricorn? What is the message? Why is the hangman here? I'm telling you, the king of swords, somebody has matured, Capricorn. That's what this is. This person had to go through this. They had to learn this lesson in order to mature. And let me tell you, four pentacles at the bottom of the deck, this person did not want to learn this lesson. They did not want to grow. They did not want to go through any type of transformation they resisted this change for as long as they could so somebody could also be very selfish as well this is somebody like if you had a child with this person or you live with this person this is somebody that liked to hold on to their money so they was where they was very selfish with you this person yeah didn't really want to give much they weren't really helpful when it came to um, the finances, the bills. This is somebody that wanted you to pay your way. That's what I'm getting. Like this person was like real stingy with you when it came to money. It's like you had to almost beg this person for help, for resources, especially where you have a child with this person. It's like begging someone to take care of their own kid. They just didn't want to do it. This is somebody who wanted to hold on to their money this is somebody um i'm hearing gluttony yeah this is somebody who's very greedy they did not want to spend money on you um this is somebody for some of you that rarely wanted to take you out they didn't really want to buy you anything and then i'm hearing like this is somebody that wanted to split the bills even though they had the money to pay at least all or majority of the bills and for some of you, you made like less than this person. You could have made way less than this person. But it's like they were so greedy. They were so selfish that they did not really care about the impact it was going to have on you. They didn't care about how much was going to be left in your bank account as long as theirs was full. Yeah, this person just was very much self-loathing. That's what this is giving me. Like, no mind. Like, if you were to ask this person for money, you would have to bring receipts almost. Like, this person really just gave you a hard time about taking you out for some of you, giving you money just to go, you know, get your hair done, your nails done, or, you know, helping you with the bills. It's kind of like they wanted to go half on everything or taking care of their child, you know, where you are a single parent. Somebody just really wanted to hold on to what they had. This person was so selfish when it came to you. But for some of you, when they connected to this other energy, when they got with this third party, they gave her everything 
everything you know they did not have any type of boundaries intact they gave it like all away they didn't question her they were just very giving very you know open when it came to their resources but with you they weren't that way they held back from you and for some of you it doesn't have to be money this could just be somebody holding back from you energetically not spending time with you not really valuing you but when they got over here with this other person they poured into this connection they gave of themselves they spent the time that was needed to build this relationship give me an energy for the knight of swords why is the Knight of Swords here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Knight of Swords here for Capricorn? What is the message? I have the higher thing. Yeah, somebody rushed into a marriage. They didn't even like really know this person that well. Taurus energy. But they ended up being betrayed. I feel like this person is being taught a lesson about what they invest in. Give me an energy for the Ace of Cups. Somebody really thought they had it in the bag. Like they was making a great decision. Give me an energy on the Ace of Cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the message? The Page of Pentacles. Yeah, like I said, for some of you, this person like walked away from new love. Yeah. They weren't willing to expand their horizons. This person slept on you. They slept on the empress. This person didn't see your worth. Like I said, they didn't see your value. They held back from you. They didn't think you were worthy. Give me another energy on the Ace of Cups. And they rushed to commit to someone else who they did think was worthy. Who they felt was a good choice. Give me a, who they felt was better than you. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the message? Why is the Ace of Cups here? Look at this. Seven of Swords in the reverse. Give me another energy on the Seven of Swords in the reverse. The Nine of Pentacles. Now this person can see your truth. That's what this is giving me. Like where this person... For some of you, this person um, thought that you only wanted them for their money, for their resources. Now they see the truth that you're the a nine of pentacles. You're abundant by yourself. You don't need this person for anything. I feel like this energy also didn't take time to really get to know you without passing judgment. Like somebody felt that you had an ulterior motive like you came off as somebody ace of cups that had a lot of love to give that was very compassionate and this person felt like you were trying to run some type of scheme on them like this person thought you were fake you were a liar you were manipulating them and that's why they didn't trust it for some of you this person is used to coming across people like that that will use them and they felt like you were one in the same like I said, this person really didn't see you in your true light. Give me an energy on the Page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Page of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the message? Strength in the reverse. This person was very insecure. This person was very insecure. Um, for some of you, this is not going to resonate for everyone, but this person may have shown up like they were stable, but this masculine or feminine energy was really a page of pentacles. This person felt like they didn't have much compared to you. That's why they didn't choose you. That's why they didn't want to approach you. Somebody could have been going through some financial challenges. Somebody could have taken a major loss here. I'm hearing divorce. So for some of you, this person could have recently gotten a divorce and they just felt like, you know, they are starting over. They don't really have much to offer. So it made them very insecure to see you in this Nine of Pentacles energy. It's like, what can I really bring to the table? 
so they went in the opposite direction i'm also getting like this person chose someone who wouldn't challenge them to be better somebody who was of their same vibration give me an energy for rumors why is rumors here for capricorn what is the energy why is rumors here for capricorn what is the message I'm hearing um, come as you are. So for some of you um, where I was saying this person really don't have much or didn't have much. For some of you, this is current energy. This person is at a page of pentacles. Somebody could have lost a lot in this relationship, in this connection. This person could have recently gotten a divorce. And so now you're over here looking abundant and this person feels insecure because once they did have the money they had the resources to come in and give you an offer you know this person was on their high horse you know they were feeling themselves but now they're lacking in the financial department so it's making them very insecure and they don't know how to approach you but spirit is telling this person to come as you are yes you know of course you want someone who is stable but at the same time, Spirit is saying not everything is about money, resources. You can always rebuild. People, you know, lose money every day and people gain money every day. You know, life fluctuates. Finances fluctuate. You know, you're going to have highs and lows. So this person is telling, Spirit is telling this person to come as you are. That message is for someone. Give me an energy for rumors. Why is rumors here for Capricorn? What is the message? Why is rumors here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Or Capricorn spirit could be telling you this. Come as you are. You may feel like you don't have enough to offer someone because you're just focused on the tangibles. But relationships are based on more than just you know the material assets because you know people lose possessions every day like i said people lose money every day money fluctuates you know you can be on top one day and at the bottom the next you can be at the bottom one day and on top the next you know it's life give me an energy for rumors why is rumors here for capricorn what is the message Why is rumors here for Capricorn? The tower. I feel like um, Capricorn, you're going to be shocked to hear about some rumors that have been going around about you. Yeah, this person is going to come and tell you what has been said about you, Capricorn. Somebody definitely wants to come back your way. Yes, they did make a bad decision. They chose wrong. For some of you, this person was listening to the rumors and the gossip. But they've learned a major lesson here. For some of you, you know, like I said, this person was a four of pentacles. They held back from you. They could have, you know, held back their resources, their energy. And they ended up going through a loss financially. Yeah, somebody was humbled here. Where they were on their high horse feeling themselves, somebody has been humbled. Strength in the reverse. But this person is coming in to tell you what was being said about you. This could be family, friends. For some of you, I'm hearing co-workers. But you're going to be shocked um, by this information. I feel like this person is trying to right their wrongs. This is somebody who's reflecting back over every aspect of their life and they're trying to make amends with as many people as they can. Somebody has matured. Somebody has wisened up and you're one of the people on this person's list. You know, they are coming back in. It doesn't mean that you have to accept this person back, but at least hear them out, allow them to apologize, but they are going to be telling you something about what was said about you. You. And for some of you, whatever was being said about you, that dictated this masculine's choice when it came to love. That's why this person went in the opposite direction, went away from you because of what people had to say. I feel like this person also learned a major lesson about listening to other people as well because this person got themselves into a mess like they made it look pretty for the public, but there was a lot of things that happened behind closed doors. 
And for some of you with the Ace of Cups, this person had to go through this because they needed to heal. It was some childhood issues that they needed to resolve. Give me an energy for Halloween. Why is Halloween here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is Halloween here for Capricorn? What is the message? Oh, we death and the devil. So Capricorn, this is your energy as well as Scorpionic. Listen, this person was real toxic, was very low vibrational. Whoever they got with was like toxic as well. Um, this could have been like a karmic soulmate that they were tied to. But yeah, this person um, had to go through some major changes. Somebody had to go through an awakening. They had to learn how to gain, gain control over their addictions, whether it's lust, substances, whatever it is. Somebody needed to practice self-control here. Somebody also needed to clear their energy of anyone around them that was going to keep them stagnant, keep them stuck in this low vibrational energy. They had to detach fully. For some of you, this person had to pull back from a karmic, a third party, whether or not they committed to this person, they got married, they know that they needed to pull back their energy because somebody was keeping this person trapped in this devil energy here. These people definitely celebrated together. I'm hearing wine. So these people could have liked to drink together. They partied together. But yeah, this masculine was not at his best when you were with him or when you met him. But now somebody has changed. They has have evolved with this queen of swords. I mean, king of swords to the hierophant. This person has become very enlightened. Yeah, very enlightened. Ace of Swords, King of Swords, the Hierophant. This person could have Taurus highly aspected, but yeah, they are awoke now. Yeah, this person can see. Somebody's trusting their intuition. Um, they have self-control. So let's pull some final messages. Spirit, why is this important for Capricorn? What is the message? Yeah, this person was being driven by the devil. This person, you know, couldn't see the forest from the trees. They couldn't really see what was happening around them. They weren't paying attention because they were so consumed with this toxic lifestyle. For some of you, it took this person a while to come up out of this devil energy. It took this person a while to turn over a new lease on life, but they finally have. Somebody has changed for the better. You know, this person is starting over from scratch. For some of you, this person may not have much, especially when it comes to the material assets of life. This is somebody that had a lot initially. So this is a major change, but this person is happy. I'm just looking at how this man is smiling on this Hierophant card. This person is happy. This person has peace. And there's no price that you can place on peace. Um, I have Justice of the Five of Pentacles. Yeah. Somebody could have also had some legal issues as well. Somebody could have lost their home. Someone could have experienced homelessness. Like somebody took some major L's here. But yeah, this person's stability was significantly impacted with justice to the five of pentacles for some of you um what this person went through financially is their karma for how they treated you somebody left you out in the cold so spirit god left this person out in the cold when it comes to their stability yeah this person couldn't get a prayer through until they decided to change somebody went through a lot i'm telling you capricorn someone went through a lot but it was needed because somebody needed to become wiser. They needed to grow up. Libra energy on justice. Let's pull one more additional message. Spirit, give me one more additional message for Capricorn. What is the energy? One more additional message for Capricorn. What is the energy? One more additional message, please. Surrender. Confirmation, Capricorn. I can release my need to control. This person had to surrender. Somebody didn't want to give anything up. 
So God, you know, orchestrated some events where this person had no other choice but to give it up. For a lot of you, people ended up walking away from this masculine once he started losing his money yeah this person um really saw who his true friends were family members you know this lover or, or whoever he chose to commit to yeah the mask fell off once this person went to the five of pentacles once this person lost everything or almost everything but this only allowed this masculine to surrender fully surrender fully to his purpose to his path bottom of the deck self-esteem I possess gifts of the soul that benefit me and others. Yeah, for some of you, this person likes to showboat, like to wear the finer things in life, but it was only to mask his lack of self-confidence. Somebody was running away from their true selves, running away from their real identity. And now somebody is embracing it. Yeah, surrender self-esteem. This is somebody surrendering to the real them, their true selves, and not caring about what other people think. I'm telling you, this person is so happy. Like, this person may only have, like, $5 in their pocket, but they're happy. They're at peace. They see life differently. This person is not um, materialistic anymore. Yeah, somebody has changed for the better. They've been, they've awakened. So Capricorn, this is your reading. I hope it resonates. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.